Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. I'm Carly. And I'm Edge. And today we're watching Blue Lock episode 22. So the match between Rin and Isagi is probably going to finish up in this episode, I'd imagine. I, it's 4-3 at the moment. Uh, Rin just scored an epic free kick. Yep. And it's good to see him trying a little bit harder. He knows that he can't slouch around in this in this match. We also saw Bachira come to the realization that maybe he's been left behind by these two monsters that he wants to play with so bad. It makes me so sad. Yeah, so I'm, I'm hoping that we get to see him get into the game because he's kind of been distracted. Yeah. If you guys are interested in signing up to our Patreon, you'll gain three to four weeks of early access to our current shows, and you'll also find reactions that are exclusive to our Patreon. If you're interested, you can check out our link in the description below. But anyway, should we get into it? Let's get into it. Do you reckon we'll get to four all? Or do you reckon Yeah. Bruins team will score the winning goal? It's anime. Four all. Four all. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit! <laughs> yeah, I want Barrow to just body slam that guy. <laughs> I'm ready for it. <laughs> Is he allowed to do that? I guess. Oh my gosh. Take a deep breath. Everything's okay. <laughs> Barrow doesn't like that. Yes. Uh... Someone doesn't hug Bachira by the end of this show, I'm gonna be pretty pissed off. <laughs> I know, even if it's his mum. Where is he? He's gonna look here again. Ooh. Oh, nice. That's really good off the ball movement. Mm. Oh, he's in the perfect spot. Oh, yeah. Don't fluff this. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, that music was so good. Dude. Penrith! <laughs> Come on, do something! Yes, he's... Yes, yes, yes! He's overrun it now. He's dummied it! Come on. He's oh, dummied oh, it! Oh, please! No, he hasn't. Oh. No goalie. <laughs> I thought he dummied it to someone else, but he backheeled it. That's huge. <gasps> wow. I was going to be pissed off with Isagi there, but he came through. Oh, no. Rin is rattled. He's about to murder someone, I'm telling you now. He had a backup plan. I yeah. love that. Yeah. That shot. That was awesome with the hand like that. Yeah. You see those goals a lot. Yeah? Yeah, it's really cool when someone crosses the ball in, you just flick it behind like a back heel. Mm. Who's going to score the winning goal? Place your bets. Well, if Bachira has his awakening, then it'll be their team. My that's the only unknown thing right now. 
My guess is actually Bachira is going to score the winning goal. I would be happy. I would. Look at him. Stop. I'm going to cry. I'm so upset. <laughs> oh my gosh. He's still man. in his words now. This guy needs a peppermint tea. <laughs> Chamomile. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Love the voice actor. He's fantastic. Very good. And yes, we know it's Tsuki. He's he's voiced so many characters that we've been watching recently. Yeah. <laughs> I can't hate him. I just can't. Someone gonna two foot him? Up. No, 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 no. I'm not what gonna does say. That mean? No, 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 Carly, don't worry about it. Okay. No, he's gonna chest it down. But also what? Ah! Ref, are we going to call a foul here for a high foot? What are we talking about? <laughs> Come on, Bachira! Let's go, Bachira! <laughs> I mean, the monster doesn't look stressed, so I'm kind of relaxed right it's now. It's kind of cute. Yeah. Oh, oh shit. Man just took him down. <gasps> no, yeah, it's a hundred percent. Bachelor are gonna be scoring the winning goal. Aww. I feel like Nagi's good at telling people what they need to hear. His world has just crumbled down. <gasps> Finally! Chills! Chills. <laughs> <Interesting>. <laughs> I'm really enjoying Barrow, man, yeah, the last few too. episodes. He's been fantastic. You will never walk alone. That's why I have this. <laughs> oh, that was kind of sexy. I'm not going to lie. <laughs> He's about to erupt. Please. please. <laughs> it's it's going to happen. This is the only way I'm okay with their team winning. Look, actually, they do this really well. Mm -hmm. All the visuals and stuff that accompany what the characters are thinking. Fantastic. Come on, he's got to do something with this newfound energy. Oh, that's a ripper ball. Best supporting actor role. Mm, what's going to happen here? With the goal line clearance, he gave him one more chance. It's gonna fall to Bachira. Oh, come on, dancing man, take it away. Just running straight for goal on the counter. <laughs> Isagi had to take the gamble to take that shot, probably knowing full well that if he missed, they were going to counter. Yeah, he's definitely about to evolve. Mm. For him to say, like, for the monster to piss off. Yeah, I never realized that the monster was actually holding him back. Oh, did he not make him? Yep. Oh, yes. Dang. Oh. oh. 
You're allowed to go and touch someone like that? It's just a bit of body and body. There's a triple nutmeg. Three in a row. This is some filth. Yeah, some spicy filth. He's going to flick it over Nagi. I guarantee he's going to flick it over him. Oh dear. He's not passing it though. He might have to. He's getting triple tape. He won't do it. My goodness gracious what me, what's he, he doing? doing? There's no stopping him now. <gasps> <laughs> Did he just peer away his way out of that? <laughs> <laughs> Going yeah, back yeah. to his roots. I love that. <laughs> Oh, chills. I love oh, that. Oh my gosh. There's no way. No! <laughs> oh, you bastards. That is a sickening cliffhanger. Treating us. This guy's a goose, man. <laughs> <laughs> Without even trying. Oh no! <laughs> These are so funny, man. I love this shit. <sighs> he can't be comfortable right now. That was the best one. Glam night! I love that. They grabbed the perfect voice actor. <laughs> yeah. And just in blue lock fashion, just like that, they've diverted our uh, expectations there. And Butchera did not get the winning goal. I thought. If Bachira doesn't get this goal right now, then Isagi's team wins. Interesting. Because how are they stopping that that build up only for them to come back again and win the game? Nah, Isagi's team's got this. No, I'm not sure. Uh, I am leaning more towards it, but I don't think it's that clear cut. Because it's not like Isagi's picked the ball up on a counter attack. He's kind of he's in the last line of defense. So they've still got to build the ball up. To, yeah, but there's score. how many two more episodes to go now? Yeah, well, there's obviously more seasons planned, so it could just end pretty not abruptly, but just at the end of the match, and that's kind of it. That's wrong though. But should I just know. got rid of the monster? Well, he's just not there yet. He's not at the level. Yeah, he went on the whole journey. It was like he was saying goodbye to a part of himself, but it was holding him back. But guess what? He probably should have passed it to Rin. No, I wouldn't have liked that. No, but I think they would have scored and won the game. Yeah, but I wouldn't did. have liked it because he had to go through. He had to go through that alone. Well, I like he it. To, he had to unleash the egoist in himself, and that was the ultimate egoist thing to do. Even I, if he didn't score, I know that. But I think the best part about that was Isagi knew it straight away. Just the first glimpse he got of Bachida nutmegging him, he's like, "Okay, he's changed." Yeah. So rather he than ran straight up, it rather than cover to Rin. Even though Rim was running into the oh, open space, yeah. he predicted that Butchita was going to go all alone. Yeah, he saw that look in his eye. He could just tell. Yeah, that was kind of cool. Um, I loved what he said to him, Isagi. He said, "Like, oh, I'm so I'm happy that you've like finally caught up or something like that." Mm. Yeah, that was nice. It was like he was proud of him in that moment. Yeah, paid him some respect there. That was great. Um, I really loved the build up. I thought the music was fantastic mm. and. The visuals, again, really well done. Yeah. And context given to the character was great. Really good. I do uh, think Nagi is here to to tell people what they need to hear. Like, he was brutal with Rio, but it's what Rio needed to hear. Yeah, he's blunt. It's not like he's unnecessarily just saying mean things. Yeah, I think sometimes there's a way to say it, but... 
Yeah. A good person and a good friend will always kind of just tell you the truth, right? Yeah. Rather than try to protect your feelings. Yeah. In my opinion. So I, I think he did that with Rio. With Butchera, I mean, I wouldn't call them friends, so it's slightly different. But, yeah, he told him what he needed to hear. I don't know if that was Nagi's intention necessarily. He's on an opposing team to Bachira. He doesn't really know Bachira. Well, they played together, the three of them. They were in the original team together. Were they? No, yeah, you're right. You're right. You're Zagi, right. Nagi, Nagi, and Bachira. Yeah, you're right. So maybe they are kind of friends. Okay. Yeah, I like where your head's at there. I think that's a that's a good point. Nagi's done that on on a couple of occasions, hasn't mm. he? Mm. And it's always been to people not on his team. Yeah. He's the one with the least amount of experience, too, yeah. playing the game. I mean, he, he only picked it up recently, which is really cool. Yeah, Rin's goal line clearance. Rin did some crazy shit this episode, too. Butchita was really good. I'm trying to think of MVP. I think it actually might be Usagi. Scored the back heel. De- mm. He defeated Rin again. <laughs> um, but I'm he, so proud of Bachira. I am, too, but... I know, he didn't score. We've got to be ruthless here, Carly. Yeah, okay, yeah. <laughs> I don't actually think Bachira. I want to give it to Bachira. I don't actually think he's MVP. I'm actually quite surprised that Isagi has been able to match Rin this well. I know. He did. He beat him. He's beaten him twice now. Twice? Yeah. Beaten him a couple of times in terms of uh, during this game uh, in their one on one battles. Mm-hmm. Uh, Rin still, I think, has the, the upper hand. Well, well, Isagi's got the ball now. Doesn't matter. It's whoever wins. I'm going to say MVP probably goes to Isagi. Bachira. I'm glad we both agree. <laughs> I think it goes to Isagi. He, he's reading of others, like the way he read Bachira, knew what he was going to do there, saved um, the final goal. Yeah, not only did he score a really good goal against Rin, he also prevented their team from losing just now. Yep. So, so- Bachira. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, MVP goes to Isagi for this one. The equalizing goal and then also saving the match. Mm. Got to go to Isagi, I yeah, think. Yeah, he has really been cooking. He has been cooking for sure. Yeah. I really like his voice actor. Yeah. Who's Butcher's voice actor too? For some reason, I heard Mob in his voice, ah. but I don't think it is. Someone would have said that already. Uh, I might look it up later, but I'm a big fan of Isagi's voice actor. I think he's so good. Yeah, he's really good. Do you think after seeing Bachira in this game, because I know last episode you were saying if Isagi's team wins, they're not choosing Bachira. Do you think after what you've seen here, they will be more likely to choose Bachira? Interesting. Because he's awakened. I mean, I was dying on the hill that Nagi was dying on too. He was like, look, if we win, I want Rin. I don't want to choose you, Bachira. And He wasn't necessarily saying that. He was saying, you don't, evolve. don't think you're safe. Like, yeah. You know, he said, are you purposefully trying to lose? But what's he done? What, what's he done? What's Bachira done in this match to deserve? He's awakened. But, nah, but it led to nothing, unfortunately. Hey, look, Bachira's my yeah, favorite character. But we have to give him a chance because he's just awakened. Yeah, right now, I think they would choose Rin. We are not on the same page. No, <laughs> but I'm just trying to, I keep trying to put myself in like, I'm fine tuning my mind to... Predict what Blue Lock's going to do. Blue Lock does things very differently to most anime, right? It's not like, uh, what's that main trope? Power of friendship, whatever it is. You know how that's like the main trope in anime? And granted, I love it. I think it's so good. I love that trope. It's just not in this. It's not in Blue Lock. So I'm trying to think like what they would do because they've obviously done things very different. That moment sets up for Bachita to score. And guess what? He does score. But why would they add that scene in with Isagi and Bachita before the game? He was like, I'm winning you back. Why bother doing any of that? Things can change, Carly, when you're in the heat nah, of the moment. I don't think so. No. <laughs> Carly is dying on that hill. <laughs> she is set in, in her ways. Yep. Now, more importantly, did you say you'll never walk alone? Yeah. You want a baby? <laughs> <laughs> that was epic. I didn't expect that from you at all in that moment. Where did you learn that? You actually know what, what do that you mean? Of course I know. Yeah, but you don't pay attention it's my favorite to team. that. Stop. <laughs> you just say that because you're probably scared of me and <laughs> how I react if you choose any other team. Carly doesn't watch it. Uh, I do. No, I watch every game. No, don't don't get <laughs> fooled by that. But I appreciate you saying that. It's perfect for that scenario too. I feel like you didn't just throw it in, you threw no, it in it makes where sense. Yeah. Maybe you've been holding on to that. No, it just came to me. Oh, that's good. Yeah. I'm glad. 
I'm going to put in my final prediction. If Rin's team wins, they'll choose Isagi. If Isagi's team wins, they'll choose Rin. I'm, I'm sticking with that. If Isagi's team wins, they choose Bachira. If Rin's team wins, they choose... Isagi, I agree with you on that one. Yeah. Now, look, I would be agreeing with you in any other anime where I feel like I would not trash the writing, but I would say I would criticize the writing of building up Isagi to say that he's going to win Bachita back and that be his, you know, uh, goal for the last, I don't know how many episodes to in fact not end up choosing him once they win. I would usually trash that writing, but I feel like it's slightly different in Blue Lock. In Blue Lock, there's only one winner. And even though that's, I'm going to classify that goal of getting Bachira back as a secondary goal. His main goal is to win the whole thing. So I just feel like maybe when it came down to it, he would he would choose Rin. But you could be right. I just could be in a different mindset. I'm trying to get in the blue lock mindset. I think like the only way I'd be okay with them not choosing Bachira would be if the rest of the team didn't want him. And then, okay. you know, he had to abide by, he had to respect his team in that sense. Okay, fair enough. Yeah. Thank you so much for watching our reaction. If you liked it, please give us a thumbs up and subscribe. It would really help us out. For early access to all of our reactions, you can support us on Patreon if you'd like. And yeah, thank you so much again. We'll see you in the next one. Bye.